Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. Um, today I thought I'd film this look right here. I'm getting into the Christmassy spirit and um, it's definitely time to start thinking about what you're going to be wearing for the Christmas party if you're working um, or if you're going on a night out. And I thought this look was just really pretty and beautiful um, and, and yeah, just slot something slightly different. Um, so I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Um, and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks guys! Starting off with a concealer, I'm using this to even out the colour of my eye so that we're starting with a blank canvas and I'm just going to blend that out with a beauty blender. I want to add a little bit of depth and colour to the crease so I'm going to use this warm brown shade and, and then I will go in with a darker brown um, to deepen this up even more and I'm going to be using a Morphe E17 brush. And then all I'm going to do after applying those two um, colours, I'm going to blend that out with a Morphe E27 brush and I'm just going to blend, blend, blend. <laughs> I pretty much want to cover my whole eyelid in black, however I'm not going to apply this in my crease as this is where I will add the glitter. Um, I'm just going to take a small amount on a flat brush and, and spread it just like spreading butter um, and I'm going to apply that all over the lid. All I'm doing now is tidying up that line just below the crease and creating a slight wing. Now for the fun part, I'm going to apply some glitter primer in the crease carefully so that the glitter isn't applied too high or too low, um, just in the crease and then I'm going to start applying the glitter. Woo -woo! I'm just using a Morphe E35 brush for more precision. I've pretty much finished my eyes, I just need to apply some mascara. Um, normally I would apply some falsies but I have um, eyelash extensions on and I don't want to um, get the glue mangled up in it so, <laughs> um, so I'm just going to finish off the rest of my face and I'm going to start off with brows and I am using a Morphe E29 angled brush to apply the uh, pomade. Moving on to foundation, I thought I would give this one a try. Um, it's okay, <laughs> um, but I still love the Marc Jacobs Remarkable Foundation um, and would definitely, definitely wear it if I was going to an event such as a Christmas party um, or a night down, down. Um, so yeah, so I'm just going to blend that out with a uh, beauty blender, a damp one, um, all over the face. And I'm just going to take some concealer and apply that to um, the dark circles under my eyes, bridge of my nose, forehead and chin. And I'm just going to set that concealer all in place um, with the Laura Mercier translucent powder, my favourite ever 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 and I think I've talked about it before absolutely love it um, so yeah, I'm just going to press that in with the uh, with a beauty blender now that I've finished highlighting I'm going to move on to um, contouring and I'm just going to use this brush from NARS I can't remember what it's called um, and I'm just going to chisel out those cheekbones 
just going to warm up those cheeks with this MAC blush that I've had for absolutely ages and I'm just going to take on a fluffy brush. Using uh, Max Gold Deposit, I'm going to bronze up the face. I'm using this um, with a big fluffy brush and I'm going to take that on my cheeks and forehead as well. Um, my favourite part, which is highlighting, and I am using the Balm Mary Luminizer and I'm just going to take this on um, the highest points of my cheekbones, um, forehead, chin and nose. And for the nose, I'm just going to draw like an exclamation point um, using the Morphe E19 brush and for the rest of the areas I'm going to use the Real Techniques um, contouring brush. Now I'm going to apply some mascara, um, I'm using this Lancome mascara, another one of my faves, um, and I'm just going to apply this to my lower lash line. Um, if I was wearing false, false? If I was wearing false lashes, I would have applied this to help blend those together, um, but I'm not. So if you are, <laughs> and you are recreating this look, then don't forget to apply it to the top. I've just taken a um, nude lip liner and outlined my lips, and I'm just going in with this really, really nude um, pink gosh lipstick as well, because um, I wanted to keep the lips quite neutral because the eyes are so dark. I've just applied a little bit of lip gloss. This one's quite a metallic bronzy colour, um, just to bronze up those lips, give them a little bit of shine and make them look a bit fuller. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!